What's up guys, Snake here, bringing you part 2 of my Pokemon Snap playthrough. Now, last part, we uh, we hit the beach and uh, saw all the Pokemon in their chillaxing mode. So now, things are going to get a bit, uh, a bit darker and a bit dankier because we are hitting the tunnel and as far as I'm aware, this is not going to be as cool as the beach, but we could see some interesting Pokemon, so let's do this shit. Let's go. I seem to vaguely remember this course uh, from when I played this when I was younger. I seem to recall a lot of Magnemite and... Um... Oh, shit. Electrode. Oh. There's a way to get Pikachu on this Electrode, and I forgot. Oh, Electabuzz. Shit, look at this guy. Did that one just explode? Fuck, I missed. Uh, where the hell is he chasing? Oh, Kakuna. Ah, oh, shit, quick! No! Oh, I am not with it today, guys. Quick, get it! Yeah, snap that bitch. Oh, shit, look at this. That would have been a good photo. Right, I'm going to have to try and memorise all these little uh, events. Try and get it on the next playthrough. Because we missed some good opportunities there. Apologies for that. Oh, look at this. Whoa! Zubat. Ah, oh, there's an egg. What was that egg? Was it an Ella kid? Maybe? That's ghastly. I think I don't know that much. Ghastly, ghastly, however you pronounce it. Yeah, that's an egg. I don't know how to get it to hatch or anything, but... I'll figure it out at some point, I'm sure. I need to unlock these damn apples or fruit, or whatever the fuck it is, because I can't lure the Pokemon or get them to do any cool stuff. Shit, magic up. I think I just got in there. Oh, what the hell's through these doors? It's amazing this thing still works, to be honest with you. Okay, there's something to the right, and sort of ghastly flying around. Oh, Diglett. I'll get back to that in a sec. Let's get these, uh... I oh, know they're not doing anything interesting. Diglett's still around? He's, yep. Alright, we've got Diglett. I think you can make him evolve into a dog trio as well, but again, don't know how to do that just yet. I think it's something to do with these switches. If I hit all of those, maybe. We need to, uh, need to unlock those first. Damn Oak being stingy with his fruit again, that's what it is. The fuck is that? That's not a Pokemon, I'm sure. It's a structure, I think. This is a well ambiently lit cave. To be honest, this is lit better than most houses. Look, I mean, look at this funky purple light going on. Ah, oh, here we go. Now, there was... Oh, yeah, they blocked the photograph. I remember that. Wankers. There was a way to make them um, evolve into Magneton, but I don't know how to do that, I'm afraid. And there's something to do with this one as well. I think he blows it up and then... I don't know, something comes from those rocks or some shit. Noisy little fuckers, aren't you? Well, we only caught a few of those Pokemon in these uh, pictures in this round, guys. Definitely gonna have to find uh, a way of making these Pokemon do more interesting things. I'm sure Professor Oak's gonna lecture me about it in a sec. First, we've got to head through the old uh, Stargate SG-1 portal and return back to the lab. I took a few snaps on that last one. 38, yeah, that's not a bad haul. Right. What have we got here? No Pokemon in that picture. Ah, it was a Haunter, not a Garcy. Bit too far away. What's the best one of Electrode? Maybe... I already missed that one, I think. Where's that first one with his face? Maybe just get that one. For now. I can get enough one, I'm sure. Electabuzz... Uh, that one was a good one. No, that one. That's an action shot if I ever saw one. 
Uh, then I'll get Trude. Uh, Zubat, here we go. Uh, that one's better, I think. What else we got? Uh, Pikachu. Didn't get some good ones of him, I'm afraid, but I've got some nonetheless. Diglett, yep, he counts. That's a good one. Uh, what else? Yeah, that doesn't recognise Magnemite, I'm afraid. What about Magikarp? He must have recognised Magikarp. No? Ah, oh, recognised Haunter, right. Uh, that one's a bit better, I think. Ah, uh, that one can't be submitted. Yep, Magikarp, here we go. Uh, that one, maybe? Or is he... No, we go for that one because uh, the other one was pretty high. These ones... Oh, yeah, right. That's good. Let's get used to Oak. Let's go. Professor Oak's check. Dun, 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 dun. Yeah, that one was a bit generic. He's just rolling. I can't remember how to get Pikachu on him. I really cannot. I'll have to try and figure that out at some point. I think that's the first time he's ever praised me on the size of the picture. Normally he just says so so. Oh, rolling. That counts as an action shot. Cool. Well, that picture was a lot better than I thought. <laughs> I thought it was pretty generic. Alright, Electabuzz. He's being self destructed by Electrode, so this one's going to be a good one. Yeah, oh, there you go. I didn't think the uh, sizing would be praised for that long. It's a blast. Her, her, her. Aren't you funny? How's the technique? Damn right, he's in the middle of the frame. What do I look like? Amateur? What is this? Amateur hour? Haunter. Okay. Uh, this one's not going to be a brilliant photo. Yeah, he's pretty far away. Could have guessed that much. Magic up jumping. So, surely I should get some good points for that. It splashed, yeah. The most amazing move of all time. Two thousand four hundred points for a magic art. That is unheard of. Zubat. Did anyone else hate the guts out of Zubat in uh, the original Pokemon games on the Game Boy? Remember Mount Moon and Rock Tunnel? Those were little bastards. Leech Life and Supersonic. It's enough to put anyone off Zubat for life. I sure as hell never caught one. Fuck that. Your Pokemon isn't in the middle of the frame. Oh, you're just being picky, Oak. You're just hard to please. Oh, right, okay. So it's across the board. The Pokemon, like, cross over between levels. I thought it was between each one. Okay. I don't think this one's going to be better than the uh, Beach Pikachu. Wait, no, I could be wrong. Uh, no, this one's better, isn't it? No, it's not. Keep the beach, Pikachu. Right, Diglett we haven't seen before, so this one's a new one. Pokemon right in the middle of the frame. Decent. Now, any more? No. That's not bad. Wait, Snake, let's return to the lab. He said that last time, he still never gave me anything. Welcome back. Welcome back. You take pictures at a good pace. To make your work easier, here's a present for you. Oh, here we go. It'll come in handy for taking Pokemon pictures. Would you like to be closer with Pokemon? And use the apple-shaped Pokemon food. Apple shape? Why don't you just call it an apple? It's clearly just an apple. It's not Pokemon food. It's human food, too. It's food. It's a fruit. When you are not focusing on your camera, press A to throw it. Right, okay. Pokemon in the distance will happily come closer when you use this item. If you want to throw farther, look up slightly and throw it. Here's a hint for you. Throw some Pokemon food to an electrode that is not moving and see what happens. Alright, okay. No, do not repeat anything. Oh, I've got it. Right. So let's head to the tunnel. Yes. Now we can use this uh, 
new fruit device or simply an apple to uh, try and get some cool snaps. How do I use this thing? Ah, okay, let's see. Whoops. <laughs> I accidentally knocked Pikachu over. Whoops. I think there's a way of getting Pikachu on this thing, but obviously I've uh, failed that, which is kind of annoying. <laughs> Uh, I've already got that photograph. What happens if I get Electabuzz? Ah. And he doesn't do anything, okay. Right, how else can we use this thing? Is there a way of hitting Kakuna, maybe? That could be a hard shot, though, to be fair. Quick, hit him! Ah, oh, I missed. Oh, hey. Nope, he's not interested. So, Electabuzz don't like apples. Uh, not sure how else. These explode when you hit them. That'd be a good shot, though, to be fair. Uh, missed that. Oh, the egg. Maybe I can. Uh... I swear Pikachu used to do something to the egg. Oh, shit, I knocked Pikachu over. Come on, get to the egg. Get to the egg. Isn't he meant to do something to the egg? Well, no. That sucked. Uh, oh, magic cop. I think I got some good points on this uh, course the last time I was here, though, to be fair. Uh, I'm pretty sure Haunter's not going to do anything. Nope. Didn't think so. What about these? <laughs> Good shot. And oh! That was quite cool. Uh, I'm not going to be able to hit him, am I? No, that's not doing anything. I'll try and get this one. Yeah, got him. Because he does some of. Thunder punch thing and seems to turn these TVs on. Ah, that's cool. I uh, don't know how to turn those ones on though, I'm afraid. Oh, I remember this. Yeah, there was a light that come on these and um, it made a pincer like silhouette on that wall and that counted as a sign. But uh, I've got to turn the power on somehow and I can't remember how to do that. Go over there, come on, get the fruit, get the fruit, come on! Get the fruit, make a megaton! There we go. Is that it? Oh, forgot about that one. Don't know what that unlocks. There's a weird theory with um, Magnemite and. Uh, his evolved form, and Magnemite weighs something like, I don't know the exact figure, it's something like three pounds, but when he becomes a Megaton, and that's three Magnemites put together, it's somehow like 30 pounds, it's like 10 times the amount, even though it should only be three times the amount. Some weird shit going on in the Pokemon world, I can't explain it. Right, okay. Be that good of Pikachu? No, I didn't. Ah, oh, how do I unchoose this? Uh, no, wait. Try. Yeah, there you go. We'll submit that because that was quite a good close up. Um, what about Magikarp? No, it wasn't that. Ah, well, it was closer. We'll try it. We'll try it. See if it's any better than the last one. Uh, we'll also submit that because I waited till it was pretty close. Now, can I get one with him doing Thunder Punch? That one maybe. We we'll go with that one. Although there is there is one of them punching, I think. We we'll do that one actually. I might slightly get more points for that. Um Aha, yeah, we've got to submit Magnemite. That one's better. It's got more than one in as well. Oh Magneton, not Megaton. My bad guys. Magneton. That's the one. 
Now we'll submit. That one's pretty good. That one's quite close up. Yeah, Magneton. My guy. My bad. Not Megaton. That's from uh, some Fallout. Don't know how I mix that up. Right. Let's submit this bitch. Dun 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 dun. Let me see. It's electric. Yeah, I know, but this one's better. Surely it's closer. Let's have a look. Yep. Almost a thousand points on the size alone. That is damn good. I suppose. Damn right, it's exploded. Yeah, see, I've got much better points. So we use that one. Magikarp. Probably not. Well, I can't even see it in the next picture. Yeah, the size is better. Splash in as usual. Much better. Uh, Zubat. This one, I'm not sure if it's going to be any better. Oh, yeah, it is. Better size. So it seems I've got to wait until the Pokemon are like literally right in front of the lens. It's weird. So those three are all improvements. Uh, Electabuzz, I've got him doing Thunder Punch, I think. So that one should be worth. Ah, oh, no, the other one got exploded. Probably. No, this one's not going to be as good, I don't think. Although the pose did get more points. Yeah, I didn't think it would get more. We'll keep the uh, exploded one. Magnemite, yep. I couldn't get him last time because I was doing that weird, like, defense mechanism thing where they vibrate and make a weird metallic sound. It seems apples solve all Pokemon problems. And then Magneton, this one should be good because this one's right up close. Still says it's so so though, of course. I didn't expect anything else from Oak. Your Pokemon isn't. Oh, yeah, he's being picky. Come on. Still, got 15 kinds. That's, uh, that's a pretty decent haul. There is a hidden path in the tunnel. That must be the one where the electrode is defending. There's a hidden path. Welcome back. Welcome back. Now, I am going to, yeah, I'll tell you what guys, I'll go back to the tunnel and I will focus on trying to get the, um, the special pathway and I'll try and get some uh, other little events that I missed the first time around. So we'll go for a third time, but this time we'll just focus on trying to get the little events that I missed. I want to, I don't know how to get the Pikachu to, uh... I don't know how to get him to go on this little electrode thing here. Because there was a way of getting him on it, so he like rolled. I think maybe where this isn't a, uh, a ROM, or like a physical ROM, you know, like the proper game, I think that's why it's uh, glitching out on me a little bit. Because there are there ways of getting things to happen, like little events Pokemon used to do, but no matter. I did say from the start this was always going to be a strict, um, just a level completion playthrough. Uh, so I'm a bit too busy to do all the uh, ins and outs of the whole game. So yeah, we're just aiming for a basic level completion on this walkthrough, guys. There's nothing else I can do around here, really. Except blow all these up. <laughs> Is this technically a uh, murder? I don't know. I'm making all the electrodes blow up. Look at, all the, look, look at my path of destruction and death. Even the cocooners are saying fuck that and hiding in the trees. Or well, the cave, rather. Actually, where are they vanishing? That's that's a cave roof and they're somehow disappearing into it. Like it's made of marshmallow. That is not right. Come on, Pikachu. I know you used to be able to electrocute this thing. I remember it now. He used to electrocute it and it, it woke up and it was like... I can't remember what Pokemon it was. And he's not doing it. You bastard, Pikachu. You've let me down. See if we can hit Magikarp. Oh. <laughs> I hit him, but the dumb thing didn't even count. What about Zubat? Can we hit him? Because this is literally just a mucking around playthrough now. Missed. See, I've got these two generators started, but it's not enough to power the whole station. And I cannot for the life of me remember how to do it. But we'll piss these guys off just to uh, have a little fun. 
Come at me, bro. I thought I'd get those two photos. They're pretty good. Diglett doesn't do anything though. Pikachu, nope. No. I feel like I swear you could have got Dog Trio as well. My uh, memories of this game obviously aren't as strong as I thought they were because I used to know the ins and outs of this game and I played it a hell of a lot when I was younger. <laughs> hey, what a shot. Come on, face me. Oh, no. That's a nice touch though. I can't remember how to get that on, that's the only annoying thing. Makes a pincer sort of silhouette. But, oh well. Right, let's try and get this secret path, which I'm fairly certain is, you know, in here. Come on. I'm not going to hit him, am I? Yes, I got him. Come on, come on. There we go. I knew I could get it. Yeah. Now, I don't know where this takes me. Ah, okay. One picture has been taken. Three pictures. Let's just quickly get these. Uh, what's this? That's nothing. Okay. Elector bars. Nah, they're not going to be as good as the other one. I might as well just get these. We won't keep you waiting. Oh, maybe that thing I did unlocked the next level. Maybe that's what I was meant to do. Yeah, yeah, you found a split in the path. According to my research, that split should link to a new course. Yeah, there you go. That's basically how I had to progress, so yeah, I needed to do that anyway, guys. I've also made a link from my lab. You should go right away. I'll go when I'm good and ready, Oak. Don't tell me what to do. Volcano! Yeah, I remember this level. Right, well, that's the end of part two, guys. I hope you enjoyed. Um, again, just to reiterate, just a basic level completion, so... Volcano level, we'll be doing the same, just get that level completed to give you a whole walkthrough in its basic form. Right, thanks for watching guys, see you in part 3. This is Snake.